Hello everyone. In my previous videos, I told you about temperate grasslands, location and climate, plant and animal life of temperate grasslands and human life in temperate grasslands. So today we are going to do a quiz. So let's start the quiz. This quiz is related to our topic, the temperate grassland regions. First, I am going to start with complete the pairs. Prairies, Canada, dash, Russia. And the correct pair is steps. Prairies, Canada, steps, Russia. American Indians, semi nomadic hunters. Kyrgyz, dash, nomadic animal herders. So, American Indians, semi nomadic hunters, and Kyrgyz, nomadic animal herders. Cowboys, prairies, dash, Pampas, Gauchos, Cowboys, Prairies, and Gauchos, Pampas. Prairies, Northern Hemisphere, Dash, Southern Hemisphere. And the answer can be Pampas, Downs, Belt. So, Prairies, Northern Hemisphere, Pampas, Downs or Veld, Southern Hemisphere. Dash, Animal of Australia, Emu, Bird of Australia. The answer can be Kangaroo or Dingo. So, Kangaroo or Dingo, Animal of Australia, Emu, Bird of Australia. Now, let's move towards fill in the blanks. As very few trees grow here, the grasslands are also known as dash. Treeless plains. As very few trees grow here, the grasslands are also known as treeless plains. Huge herds of dash used to once graze the prairies. Bison Huge herds of bison used to once graze the prairies. Cotton, dash and dash are the main crops grown in the grasslands. Wheat and maize. Cotton, wheat and maize are the main crops grown in the grasslands. Animal herders called dash take care of livestock in the prairies. Cowboys Animal herders called cowboys take care of livestock in the prairies. Estancias are huge dash where cattle and sheep are raised. Ranches Estancias are huge ranches where cattle and sheep are raised. The word prairie was used by dash traders 
who were one of the first European people to see such open grasslands. French. The word prairie was used by French traders who were one of the first European people to see such open grasslands. Now, choose the correct answer. The temperate grasslands of Australia are known as dash, downs, pampas, taps, or belt. And the answer is A. Downs. The temperate grasslands of Australia are known as downs. The dash is a flightless bird and second largest bird after the ostrich, owl, dodo, ibis or emu. And the correct answer is emu. The emu is a flightless bird and the second largest bird after the ostrich. The tent of the Kyrgyz is called a dash, yurt, teepee, igloo or big bam. And the correct answer is A. Yurt. The tent of the Kyrgyz is called a yurt. Dash is a hot wind that blows over the prairies in spring. Taroko, Kamsin, Chinook or Mistral. And the correct answer is C. Chinook. Chinook is a hot wind that blows over the prairies in the spring. Temperate grasslands are found in areas with dash, short summers and long winters, long summers and short winters, mild summers and cold winters or long summers and mild winters. And the correct answer is A. Short summers and long winters. Temperate grasslands are found in areas with short summers and long winters. Most grasslands are located in the dash, torrid zone, temperate zone, frigid zone or both in torrid and frigid zones. And the correct answer is B, temperate zone. Most grasslands are located in the temperate zone. Now let's move towards true or false. Grasslands are stretches of hilly land. This statement is false. The grasslands have only a few trees. And it's true. Dingoes carry their young in a pouch. This statement is false. Frost and snow are common in the grasslands of the Northern Hemisphere. And it's true. Grasslands have infertile soil. This statement is false. I hope that you have enjoyed the quiz. Thank you.